Is this Comanche Creek, you think? Yeah. Still Venable? Venable Creek. It's steep, it's rocky, the trail's almost bored to death. And I'm wondering why. Yeah? <laughs> Tell me to do it on the bridge. <laughs> I'm posted in a while, I'm kind of busy. But, things looking good. Got a new phone. This is the Galaxy 5, we'll see how it does. There's my hubby with his new Goodwill shirt. Looking good. I'm not doing that well. We're gained weight in sunny flats. We're trying to hike. Some days we're good, some are bad. Today's not a good one. It's sweet. But I wonder why I don't dream of hiking. I dream of cities, buildings, mysterious places, but not like looking down in a dream and seeing a trail full of rocks. I don't know. So we got done with study flats. We are definitely going back to host November. And uh, it's interesting, learned a lot. We'll be better at it, even though they told us we were really good. I felt like we weren't well prepared. But we did good. There was no complaints, which is awesome. And the place didn't burn down. But I'm a little too uh, officious, I think, and kept reporting things that, just so he would know, just in case, but I think I won't do that anymore. It's not necessary. Talk to a law enforcement. You see, if anything really bad happens, call him first. So I will. I won't tell Mondo. He's a good man. So this is part of the Rainbow Trail in the Sangres on the east-facing side. Trail's a lot better than Venable Trail. That thing is totally full of marbles and rocks and destroyed and rutted out. And you have to go way up there before you, in the wilderness before it turns around. And that's been a lot of trails. So, here we went to a Camado Lake in uh, New Mexico and a little fella graduation party, I think, got drunk. And, gently knocked on the door and, and kind of scared us so we didn't open the door and told him to go away and called the sheriff and then I thought somebody threw something at the trailer actually it turned out to be just a rivet but called him again I was texting with the, the dispatch which was really cool let me know if anything else was going on that was cool that was a, a new development for 911 but they did come out and he didn't really look around. He talked to us. And when he was leaving, he had left like 10 minutes. And I said, oh, there he is. He it sounded like Bigfoot off in the woods. Paul and I stood there. We're like, what is that? And the elk had wandered through. And I was like, oh. And then coyotes started going off. We're like, wow, maybe they ate something. So then I look up and there's this kid staggering around and he's cold and he tries to start a fire at a base of a tree. I went, oh hell, drunk kid, still drunk, man. So the cutest thing, and I will post it with this, was a note. Wait till you see it, it was so cute. We felt so good and bad at the same time. I hope he never drinks like that again, ever 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 could have got himself really hurt but Paul and the sheriff officer Tibbs thank you good man shaking both shaking their heads it's funny so went to Pueblo spent a few days with our daughter got hot we left just in time because they started construction right where we would need to get in the backyard so good, good timing so again we're here and we're gonna go down to Twin Lakes, camp out there for a couple weeks, go back to Dewey's, which is a wilderness area near uh, near Westcliff. I camp there a couple weeks because we got dental appointments. Yeah, I lost a piece of my tooth, my left lower wisdom tooth, had a little chunk come off it, and the doctor thinks because I grind my teeth at night, 
I don't think so because they don't meet on that side, but he used the professional. Didn't even need to be numbed, just just a little filling. No cavity, which is cool. So I mean there might have been, but they didn't think so. But just in case they filled the whole thing out, it was great. Good man, Dr. John at Comfort and Pebble. Wish I'd known about them before. Our dentist in uh, Canyon kind of ripped us off. So we weren't happy. Oh, look how big the trees are. Oh, that one broke over. There must have been one hell of a wind through here. Crazy winds. Seeing a lot of new growth. It rained last night for about an hour, which is cool. It really needs rain here. So, you know, early June. It's not going to have monsoon yet. So, I'm all red. New glasses. I can see my right eye anyway. So, that's been nice to have new glasses. And relax. I took two weeks off. and didn't have clients or we didn't do anything much. Just We've just been hanging out and started having clients this week. It's been cool too. And, but I feel like I gained too much weight over the winter. And I'm back where I was. So I'm not as out of breath as I used to be. And I'm not as, you know, I do get tired. I didn't sleep well last night. Too much noise. Campgrounds full. But uh, we went to bed too late. I was playing with this phone. <laughs> it went from Galaxy 4, Galaxy 2 to Galaxy 5, and it's one hell of a phone so far. I'll probably never use all of its applications or features, but it's got almost 600 gigs of room, which is awesome. It's a memory. It's got a big processor. This camera is supposed to be like the bomb. It's got all kinds of studio and stuff, so that's all. Just checking in. I don't, I don't know how many people are actually watching these, but it's sweet to do. I haven't done one in a while. My mother-in-law gave me these. I had some I had a friend die from college, and uh, didn't know him well since we left college. Since I left college, but my daughter was friends with him on Facebook, and sorry to hear. But, uh, yeah, yeah, we're doing okay. Make a little money, not enough to ding the Social Security, which is good. And, uh, yeah, watch your head, people. See you later.